Assalamualaikum and hi everyone. In this video, I will discuss <laughs> on mind test one point two C. Okay, question number one. Simplify each of the following. As I mentioned earlier in my previous video, if you had divide uh, divide here and the base equal then we just uh, subtract the power or the index so for a 4 to the power of 5, 5 minus 4 so answer is 4 it's actually 4 to the power of 1 and we didn't write the power 1 for b 7 to to the power of n minus 6 minus minus 2 so the answer 7 to the power of 2 for C m to the power of 8 minus 4 and 6 minus 1 so the final answer m to the power of 4 and to the power of 5 have a look at question D 27 divided by 9 x to the power of 4 minus 3 y to the power of 5 minus 2 so the answer is 3xy to the power of 3. For E, m to the power of 7 minus 2 minus 4. So answer m. F, negative 25 divided by 5, h to the power of 4 minus 2 minus 1. So answer negative 5, h. Number 2, copy and complete h of the following equation. So, 8 to the power of what? Divide by 8 to the power of 4 divided by 8 to the power of 4. This is actually 8 to the power of 1. So, 8 minus 4 minus 3 is equals to 1. So, the suitable value here is 8. For D, 4 minus what is 2 so 4 minus 2 and 6 minus 5 equals to 1 so for c n minus what minus a uh, 10 plus what minus 7 equals to 5 so this is 2 n minus 2 a uh, 10 plus 2 minus 7 so equals to 5 n 4 plus 2 minus 1 equals to 5. D, 27 divided by what is equals to 3? So, 27 divided by 9. Y, 6 plus first, X, 3 plus 1 minus 2 is equals to 2. Y, 6 minus 2. 2 plus 2 sorry 6 plus 2 because multiply here so 6 plus 2 minus 3 is equal to 5 so question number 3 if this determine the value of x plus y so 2 to the power of x minus 4 times 3 to the power of y minus 2 is equal to 6. 6 is actually 2 times 3. So the power here should be 1. Here also should be 1. So 5 minus 4 is equal to 1. 3 minus 2 is equal to 1. So the value of x is 5 and the value of y is 3. So x plus y equals to Okay, have a look at minus 1.2D. Number 1, use law of indices to simplify each of the following statement. So, the law of indices, if you have power raised to a power like this, you just to multiply these two index. So, the answer for A, 12, 5 times 2 is 10. B, 3 to the power of 10 times 2 is 20. C, 7 to the power of times 3 is 6 D negative 4 to the power of 3 times 7 is 21 
E A to the power of 8 times 3 is 24. F G to the power of 2 times 13 is 26. G negative M to the power of 4 times 3 is 12. And H negative C 7 times 3 equals to 21. Easy, right? So question number 2. Determine whether the following equation are true or false. As we do in the previous video, you have to do left and right side. So for the left hand side and the right hand side, this is the left and right. So we do in the left hand side first. So left hand side is 2 to the power of 4 times 5 is equal to 2 to the power of 20. The right hand side, 2 to the power of 2 times 10 is equal to 20. So this is the both is same. Then we can conclude that A is true. Okay, for B, this is left and right hand side. So we do the left first. 3 to the power of 3 times 7 is 21. For the right hand side, 3 to the 27 here change to 3 cube to the power of 4 times 4 to the power of 2 times 4 is equals to 3 to the power of 24. This is not the same. Hence, B is false. Question C, left and right, left side, 5 to the power of N, 1 to 5 change to 5 to the power of 3, to the power of 2 times 3 is equals to 5 to the power of 18. Both are not the same. Hence, C is false. For D, this is left and right hand side. Left side, negative 7 to the power of 8. The right, negative 49 change to negative 7 square. To the power of 2 times 3 is equal to negative 7 to the power of 12. Both also not the same. Hence, D is false. Minus 1.2e. Question number 1. Simplify each of the following. You have to multiply every single thing in the bracket. So 2 to the power of 2 times 3 to the power of 4 times 2. So this is the answer for A. For B, 11 to the power of 3 times 3. 9 to the power of 5 times 3 is 15. So this is the answer for B. For C, 13 to the power of 3 times 2 is 13 to the power of 6. Divide 7 to the power of 6 times 2 is 12. So this is the answer for C. Question D, 5 to the power of 3 times 4 is 15. So 5 to the power of 15 times 3 to the power of 4 times 5 equals to 20. So, this is the answer for D. For question E, M to the power of 3 times 5 is equals to M to the power of 15, N to the power of 4 times 5, 20, and P to the power of 2 times 5 equals to 10. So, this is the answer for E. Have a look at F, 2 to the power of 4, equals to 16, W to the power of 2 times 4 is 8, X to the power of 3 times 4 is 12. For G, negative 3 to the power of 6, A to the power of 5 times 6 is 30, divided by B to the power of 4 times 6 is 24. So, this is the final answer, negative 3 to the power of 6, is 200, 729 a to the power of b divided by b to the power of 24. For h, 2 to the power of 3, a to the power of 4, uh, 5 and 3 is 15 over 3 cube, 3 cube, b to the power of 4 times 3 is 12. So the final answer to the power of 3 is 8. 3 cube is 27. So this is the answer for H. Question 2. Simplify each of the following. 
11 to the power of 3 to the power of 2 is equal to 6 minus 2 times 2 is equal to 4 times 4 to the power of 2 times 2, 2 times 2 here is equal to 4. So the answer is 11 2 to the power of uh, 11 to the power of 2 times 4 to the power of 4. Okay, 6 here is actually 3 times 2. 4 here, 2 times 2. Minus because this is divide. So for B, 3 to the power of 3 times 6 to the power of 3 times 2 is 6. Minus here, 6 to the power of 4. So minus 4 is equal to 3 cubed times 6 squared. Question C. Okay, for this question, no need to find the value because the question asks you just to simplify. So C, 4 to the power of 2 times 3 is 4 to the power of 6. 6 to the power of 3 times 3 is 9. Divide by 4 to the power of 2 over 6 to the power of 3. And 4 to the power of 6 minus 2 because this is divide over 6 to the power of 9 minus 3. So the final answer 4 to the power of 4 divided by 6 to the power of 6. For question D, negative 4 to the power of 6 times 2 is 12 times negative 5, 2 times 3 is 6. This is remain unchanged. Then Negative 4, 12 minus 6 because this is divide by negative 5, 6 minus 2. So the final answer, negative 4 to the power of 6 times negative 5 to the power of 4. So have a look at question E. 2 to the power of 2 plus 3 minus 1. Plus because it's multiplied here, minus because divide here y to the power of 6 minus 2. So final answer, x to the power of 4, y to the power of 4. For f, h to the power of 3 times 4 minus h to the power of 1 times 2 is 2. Minus here because this is divide, k to the power of 2 times 4 minus 2. 2 times 4 minus 2. So final answer, h to the power of 10, k to the power of 6. For question G, m to the power of 5 times 3 minus 2 times 2. n to the power of 7 times 3 minus 3 times 2. So the final answer, m to the power of 11, n to the power of 15. To calculate this, you can use your calculator. For h, d to the power of 2 times 3 minus 2 times 2. d to the power of 4 times 3 minus 3 times 2. So the final answer b square d to the power of 6. Okay, question number 3. Simplify each of the following. So 2 to the power of 3 m okay this i multiply and divide the coefficient coefficient here 2 to the power of 3 so 2 to the power of 3 times 3 square so times 3 square here divided by 12 so this is the coefficient and then m 2 times 3 2 times 3 here plus 1 times 2 minus 7 and the power of 4 times 3 plus 4 times 2 minus 12. So you use your calculator to calculate this. So here got 6 m to the power of uh, m n to the power of 8. Here when you calculate you, you get 1. So 1 will not write the 1 here. So 
the answer is 6 mn to the power of 8. For B, this is the coefficient 5 to the power of 2 times 6 divided by 15. X to the power of 1 times 2 is 2 plus 10 minus 4. Y to the power of 4 times 2 plus 1 here minus 6. So this one, use your calculator. You get 10. X, 2 plus 10 minus 4 is 8. Y, 4 times 2, 8 plus 1 minus 6 equals to 3. So this is the final answer for B. For question C, 24 times 3 to the power of 2 or 3 square divided by 6 cube. B, 3 plus 3 times 2 minus 5 plus 3 here. Why I use bracket here? Because the this is divide, so minus bracket because this is multiplication, so we have to add the power. Power for D in the denominator is 5 and 3. Okay, so for E, 5, 5 plus, because this is multiplication, so plus 4 times 2, 4 times 2, so here 4 times 2, minus, because it divides, so minus 6 bracket. 6 plus 2 times 3. Close bracket. So use your calculator. You'll get here 1. D 3 plus 6 minus 8 is 1. 5 plus 8 minus 6 plus 3 times 2 6. 6 plus 6. So minus 12. Then equals also equals to 1. So the answer is E E. So thank you. That's all for uh, for your homework. See you in the next video.